And hello and welcome to a short match of tennis today with Matt Messias. Matt, it's great to see you. How are you today? Uh, magnificent in every conceivable way, Chris. OK, Matt, you're a specialist in terms of helping parents and children have resilience at this minute, particular time. First question to you, Matt, let's go straight in. How can parents build up their resilience for both themselves and their children at this difficult time? There's many things, Chris, but, but I'd like to focus on one in particular, and that is to um, diarise and structure time with your children. It's all about allocating time and energy to what's really important to you. Often with a lot of parents working at home at the minute, as well as having to help with their own children's education and everything else, things get merged into one. So actually putting time in the diary to spend quality time with your child and actually being there, putting away your mobile phone, being present and doing things that they want to do. I think that's a great way to one, show that you love your children and that you're happy and love spending time with them, which goes to improve relationships, which is a great resilience builder. And yourself, Chris, you know, why is it that sometimes parents and children end up having that row? OK, well, I've actually got a little slide here, Matt, just to uh, help us see exactly what this is all about. And I put this up as something called transactional analysis. And basically, it's a breakdown between the communication in that you have to ask the question on a level. So as an example, if you're a child and you're not feeling very well and you say, Mum, I'm not feeling very well. And they say, do you know what? You'll be better tomorrow. You feel hurt by that. And you need to actually have a parent child relationship. So I want you to really try and take time to ask yourself, am I doing what you've just said, which is diarising in time to even deal with a conflict situation? Can I deal with it in a transaction analysis way? Read more about this model and you'll see more. Um, so Matt, anything on that that you're thinking about in terms of how that resonates with you in this particular field right now? Yeah, yeah Chris, it's, it's about, I think, for parents and carers to think about the messages that they are sending their children. Um, how you talk to your children can either inspire and motivate, or they feel it's just criticism, which demotivates them. Say that it's, I think it's okay to model your own vulnerability. It's okay to not be okay all the time. And teach your children um, to love challenges, uh, to be intrigued by mistakes, enjoy effort, um, because that's this way they're going to build up. You'll help them build up a lifelong way or process or structure to build and repair their own confidence during challenging times. Uh, Matt, as we said, it's a short game today. So I really, really value your input. And I'm sure many people can find loads more information about you in terms of what you're doing and what you're talking about. But if anybody does need any more assistance, our contact details are here. Matt, it's been a pleasure today. Any closing remarks? Just uh, eat your vegetables, be nice to each other. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Matt. I look forward to the next game of Zoom Tennis with another participant. But for now, Matt, Messias, thank you so much for your time. Bye-bye.